Hello, and thank you for watching the Weekend Box Office Report. I'm your host, Daniel Kay, and this is the report for the weekend of December 11th through 13th, 2015. As usual, I was too busy this weekend to see a movie. I went to Las Vegas. Um, I considered seeing a movie because it's, it was either that or wander through the casinos. I walked a lot, but um, ultimately, walking just seemed like a better idea. There's one new movie in the top ten this week. It was not number one. Number one was uh, Mockingjay, the final Hunger Games movie. That made $11.4 million. Coming in at number two, though, In the Heart of the Sea, a true story directed by Ron Howard, which means it's going to be well-made and unwatchably boring. Uh, it's from Warner Brothers, and In the Heart of the Sea made 11 point even, $11.0 million. Ah, attaboy, Ron. All right, so that's it for the top ten, more or less. Coming in a little farther on down the line, at number 82 from Film Movement Pictures, Breathe. Breathe made $63. It's been on the chart for 14 weeks. It's showing on one screen. Breathe. I guess if it had been something a little less autonomous uh, in terms of body function, it might have done better. Speaking of body, coming in at number 65, Body. It's brand new. Uh, it's from Oscilloscope Pictures, and it made on its one screen $2,457. Which, by the way, is uh, uh, as a per screen average. Oh, wait a minute. Look at that. It's still lower than um, the Tom um, the uh, in the Heart of the Sea. So, Ron, good work. See, instead of a whole body, if you just put a body part in the title, you can get an extra thousand bucks. All right, well, thank you very much for watching the Weekend Box Office Report. Me, we'll be back again next week. I'll probably be talking about Star Wars. A lot.